keep it secrets to different bills. Hey, don't go dim me, you need it, I got it listed, yeah. You wanna make it, I'll show you just how to make it, yeah. I got all the rarest bills, and I ain't done, yeah. I'm from the finish to making bills like a prospect. Flow space and slashes to catching us with a lot threat. You keep the medals, cause the real ones coming up next. Only scratch the surface, still they try to drag my name in dirt, they try to bring me down. See me when you ain't like Yo, what's good, my nephews and nieces? This is your favorite uncle, Uncle Demi, and today I have another special banger for you, right? Today we finally have Wilt Chamberlain's replica build, The Big Dipper. Now, I'm going to give you two versions today, but before we get into the video, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. Liking up the video will push the video to the recommended, and of course, subscribing will put you in Naughty Game for my daily double uploads. But now let's hop into this video. So I'm gonna show you two versions of this. This is gonna be the 76ers version. Um, if you if we can get this video to 30,000 likes, um, I'm sorry, 30,000 views, I'll go ahead and drop the Golden State version. Okay, but let's get into it. So we're gonna go with this version here first. The first version is gonna be center, right-handed, number 13. That's gonna be for both, obviously. Seven foot one, 255, max out the wingspan. So that's pretty dope, right? Body shape, I wouldn't define, but you can pick any body shape that you want, okay? Now, the cool thing is, is that we're able to go 85 on a close shot to be able to get, you know what I love, the coveted fearless finisher, masher, and fast switch. Now it's even more important because they have buffed interior defense, so you definitely gotta come correct in there, okay? We're gonna go 70 on the driving layup because that will give us a dominant big man layup package. Then we're going to go 75 on the driving dunk. That is going to give us the Giannis dunk package. Um, as you can tell, you're not able to go um, to 84. All right? So even though 84 is where you get pro contact dunks, we're not able to do that. If you go above 83, it changes the name. So we're not doing that. Okay, so we're going 75 with the Giannis. Then we are going to go 90, though. 90 standing dunk. This is Will Chamberlain. We need to get the elite big man contact dunks. So we're going 90 there. And then we're going to go 84 on the post control. Um, 84 is very important because you are going to get gold post band technician. I mean, so Hall of Fame post band technician, but you also get gold dream shake. You get gold back down punisher and drop stepper. That's very important. Okay, so you're looking at 23 total there. Now, obviously here there's not much here with Will Chamberlain. He wasn't a shooter. Well, I guess I mean he was and he wasn't. He was good at the post fade, but for some reason they don't have his shooting really high in the game. Right. Um, the Golden State version one is, but that's only at 70, so it's kind of changes up a little bit. Um, 35 on a three-point shot, 50 on the mid-range, 63 on the free throw, okay? We all know he was a terrible free throw shooter, but I tried to get it up as much as we could to be like, respectful if you was in the pro on a wreck, okay? We got to get the pass accuracy up, accuracy up as high as we can. The highest we can get it, though, is only a 68, but it's still good enough because you do get silver break starter, and again... That's the best we can do. You can't go no higher than that. Go 36 on the um, ball handle. And um, note that don't worry about the speed of ball, all right? Then on the interior defense, you want to go 80 on the interior defense, 40 on the perimeter defense, 56 on the steal, and then you want to go 99 on the block. You can go 99 on offense or defensive rebound. I decided to go offensive. I just love because, you know, it's just really OP to get offensive rebounds. And then 84 on the defensive. But you can flip-flop it, okay? So when I say flip-flop it, though, you can go 85. Now, offense rebound has to be 85 if you flip it. So if you keep it like this, 84 defensive. But if you want to get 99 defensive rebound, your offensive rebound needs to be an 85. So you have to go up by one point, all right? Max out your speed with ball. Max out your acceleration. You got to get that 89 strength because, obviously, you know, as Will Chamberlain is one of the strongest players ever play. Plus, you want to get that gold bully. 78 on the vert. And then, of course, 90 on the stamina, all right? So what you're looking at is 23, 7, and 27. Basically like your blue and red pie chart if you're old school with it. But again, the 99 block, which is going to give us that crazy, insane anchor on Hall of Fame. You get Pogo Stick Hall of Fame. You get Rebound Chaser Hall of Fame. Chase Down Artist Hall of Fame. And Box Out Hall of Fame. So again, really, really dope here. You have options of rim, glass, and post takeovers. Me personally, I would just go all out with the post moves. Like, you know, I just want to go in the post. If you, especially if Hall of Fame, you know, defensive anchor and stuff, you don't need to worry about anything else. Advanced post moves and power back downs is what I would go with. And then, of course, here you have it, my nephews and nieces. We're going to look at, for the first time ever, the Wilt Chamberlain replica build, the Big Dipper. Right? Yeah, come on. Yeah. 76ers. Okay? Yeah, it's, it's here. We got it. All right? The Big Dipper. Now, we're going to go look at another version of this build, and that's going to be more more heavily on the finishing to go real crazy on how dominant he was in the finishing. So let's head over right now, and let's try to make that version. All right, my nephews and nieces. So nothing changes here. Same thing. Center, right-handed, number 13. 
We still want to go seven foot one, 255, max out the wingspan. Body shape can be whatever shape you want it to be. Now we want to go crazy. So instead of having an 85 close shot, we're going all the way up to a 93. <clears throat> now remember, 93 close shot will give you Hall of Fame fearless, fearless finisher, but <clears throat> excuse me, it's also going to be associated with your post hook. So you're going to have a really, really strong post hook here. Driving layup, nothing changes here. You can't get anything better than a dominant big man layup package anyway, so we're going to do that. This time, we're going to go 80 on the driving dunk because we'll be able to get quick drops, okay? You'll be able to get quick drops with this. There's so many good things about having an 80 driving dunk, so now you'll have an 80 driving dunk. Standing dunk, we're still going to keep it at a 90, and then on post control, we're going all the way up to 94. We all know the significance of 94 because now, as you see here, your quick first step will be on gold. That's going to be very important. Now you have 26 finishing. This one here is, again, finishes way much better than the other version. You still want to keep your mid-range the same. Go 35 on your three-point shot. This time, just go 60 on your free throw. Still want to go as high as you can on pass accuracy. We know how important that is. So we're going to go 68. Your ball handles up to 44. No speed with ball. This time on your defense, your interior defense will be an 80. You go 40 on your your um your interior defense will be 80. Your perimeter will be 40. You go 56 on your steal. You go 88 now on your block. Okay, so now it's just 88 instead of 99. But you're still able to get silver anchor. But remember, we're compensating on the defensive end to buff up our finishing. Now understand this: defense has already been buffed in tier, so I don't think you'd even need to have a 99 block anymore. But it's your preference. We still want to make sure we get the Hall of Fame box out and stuff. So we're going 94 on offensive rebound and then 84 on the def defensive. Now, again, if you want to go 94 on the defensive, just make sure you go 85 on the offensive if you want to switch these two around, okay? And then you want to max out your speed, your acceleration. Still go 89 on that vert, I mean on that strength. Max out the vert and then you'll go 90 on your stamina. So now you're looking at 26, 7, 24. Again, still a very solid build. I still went with the, pa the power back downs and advanced post moves. But yeah, rim protector, glass cleaner, and um, and put on um, and um, post takeover. So it's really your preference. There's no right or wrong answer here. It's whatever you want. And again, you're still going to get the 76ers version. It's just that now you got two different versions. You got one that's offensive heavy, and then one that's a little bit more rebounding and blocking heavy. It's really your call here about your play style. How do you want to play? Do you want to look to score, or do you look like somebody that just wants to play defense and throw outlet passes and stuff in the wreck and pro or 3v3? But it's your preference there. Again, we're now looking for two of the. Now we're going to try to get the Lakers version and a Golden State version. So, again, just, you know, sit back, relax. We'll see what we can do there. I'm not going over badges, but hopefully you enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comment section which version you liked more, right? I need to know that. Which version did you like more, the first version or the second version, right? But other than that, this is your favorite old head, Uncle Timmy. I'll be back really, really soon with another banger, man. You know, when I say I'll be back soon with another banger, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm talking about tomorrow, man. I'm out.